Oh my god. I'm sorry guys. Today, I'm gonna share with you three holy grail time-lapse tips in one minute. Let's go. Number three, shoot in manual mod M and change your exposure every 15 to 20 photos during the ramping. Giving enough photos between any exposure change is actually a great way to reduce the visual flicker on your time-lapse. Number two, change a little bit of the three settings and not just one. We all know that each settings affect your photo one way or another. So if you get a slower shutter speed, that creates light trails, a wider aperture, means a smaller depth of field and finally more ISO means more grain we all know that so it's great to change all the three settings a little bit and not just one all the time if you play a little bit with the three settings you can end up with a medium aperture a shutter speed around I will say two seconds for a cityscape time lapse and finally ISO between 200 and 400 which actually most cameras can handle today pretty well at night time. And finally, number one, choose an interesting subject during the day and during the night. You have to really pick up a good subject for Holy Grail, such as a cities or a landscape time lapse that's actually going to turn to astrophotography at night. Don't shoot Holy Grail time lapse if there is nothing interesting from start to finish. And don't forget that your subject can be the light. It doesn't have to be a physical element. Well, this is it for today's video. I hope you learned something. But if you want to learn more about day to night time lapses, you can go on my website and check my course. I have a two hours long day to night time lapse course to learn how to shoot and edit all the well time lapse videos. So just click in the link. Is it click on or click in the link? Click on. Click on the link in the description below or the comments too. And that's actually, that's actually going to take you directly to the website. That's amazing technology. Anyway, if you want to... Uh, don't, forget to <laughs> don't forget to subscribe if you like time-lapse and hyperlapse videos. And I see you in the next video. Au revoir.